shredded. And for those who have not ever been shredded or lean, you know, or maybe you forgot what it was like to be lean, it's freaking worth it, dude. It's the best. And go out and run sprints, man. Go out and run sprints. Forget running, jogging, all that stuff, cardio. I don't do cardio, I don't do jogging. Just go run sprints, five of them. Oh my gosh, the most exciting, amazing, euphoric feeling. And I uh, did a little trip up to Tahoe, check it out. I'm gonna do a little vlog here. You'll Labor Day weekend, arriving in Tahoe right now. Very, super excited and grateful to be here. Actually, hooking up with a friend of mine. We're, I'm staying with uh, Ryan Brown and I are staying together. Some of you may remember, I've talked about Ryan Brown before in Gavin Mail Global, Global Mastermind video. And I'll put a link below when I find the video. I gave a speech about how he was the, he was the number one guy I ever trained, you know, in, when I was at AmeriQuest. He was the number one rookie I ever trained. And I, I taught like kind of a cool, a valuable lesson about, you know, what he, what he talked about and what, what, we, what, what I learned from training him uh, as he became the number one trainee I've ever, I ever had. So I was staying with him and I'll put a little link to the, below the video. You can listen to the whole story. It's kind of long and kind of exciting, but really a great lesson in it. One of the Gab Mail Global Mastermind calls. So I don't know if it'll be on video or not. It doesn't matter. I'm freaking just excited to be here. Dark out, shredded, freaking ripped right now. Dude, nothing better than getting into a, getting in to like some 29 inch Levi shorts, like super, super skinny 29 inch ordering on, um, on Amazon. And they say, and all the reviews say, oh, the guys can't fit into them. The guys can't fit into them. That's all the reviews are saying. And then they show up. I ordered the smallest size 29 because that was a small size that, it was actually a cheaper price for you get the 29, that's why I did it. And I freaking get it. And then skinny shorts and they freaking fit like a glove. Amazing. Incredible, man. I'm so excited. Like they fit so good. They're 29s. And because I'm shredded and ripped, it's like freaking doesn't matter. It's like so amazing. Like 29. I, I guess I'm a 29. Done. Alright, let's do it. <laughs> I was a little like, yeah. People were watching me like, dude, guy's on a vlog right now. I know, I'm freaking doing a vlog. I'm getting into the casino. Hard Rock, probably about seven, actually 7.30 right on time. Like my time I was expecting to be here. Guess what, I'm gonna keep track of time anymore. I don't care. I'm gonna see what time. I'm like, bro, I'm on Gmail's time. I'm on my own time. I do what I want to do. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Check in when I want, do what I want. I'm just excited. Watching my... I've been watching the vlog king, Casey Neistat. The guy's just an amazing vlogger, dude. I wanna, I'm gonna try to learn, I'm learning from him. Just to, I'm in like T-ball, like just on day one. This guy's a freaking king of vlogs. If you haven't already started following Casey, you gotta watch him, dude. He's got closing in on one billion views on his channel. A billion views. Can you believe that? It's crazy, dude. Amazing. Such a freaking legend. Got the elevator to myself, a little talking. Rolling into Tahoe, man, I'm excited. Boom! Got my alkaline water though, that's for sure. So yeah, check out Casey Neistat. This guy is just phenomenal, dude. Casey Neistat, man, I love you, bro. Your vlogs are just to watch it and how he's been, been creating all this legendary stuff in his vlogs. So, so, so innovative. Can't find my room, so maybe I should just ask for help. Like, no, dude, gotta do it myself. I'm gonna ask for help, bro, figure it out. I'm gonna do it, that's it, period. I can't find my room. 864. The room's in at 833. I don't know. Where's it at? I think I got the right place now. This my room here. Another great night at the Hard Rock, one man. Sorry? Another great night here, huh? Yeah, I'm very busy. Excited. I do appreciate it. What is it about elevators, man? It's like, you know, I want to just break the silence and be like, boom, I got enthusiasm. I am enthusiastic. Hi. I love that. Remind me, I hear this has got to be a party. The party's going to get here. Now that I'm here, I've got yeah. parties freaking here, dude. Party is here, bro. Boom! 864, come join me. Boom. So people say, hey, come on my vlog, bro. Come on my vlog. Like, no, we don't want to be on a vlog. All right, fine. It's just going to be me, my friends. We got. Like, no, this is not heat. <laughs> Here we go. We're arriving into the. Oh, man. 
I think Tahoe is actually where the action is. I'm supposed to be here for the pool party. I'm here for the pool. Very nice, actually. Very nice little getup. I'm excited to be here. It's the Hard Rock. Legendary stuff. Freaking Hard Rock bunk. Yeah, bro. What's up, man? Uh, look at it's still going off around here. Oh my god, I got you guys. I found my friends. <laughs> yes. Watch on the vlog now. What's happening? I found you guys. What's up, man? What's up, brother? Good to see you, bro. What are you doing? Dude, I just, I just... We did go to the Tahoe Beach a little bit. Caught some rays. It's super windy out there. Super windy. Myself until I start walking and moving around. You know, I've been driving and we go to the beach and we had a great time, but I feel like this is the first time all day that I've really been able to get out there and just move my body and walk, get the Pellegrino water with the fasting in and going. It's just amazing. I, I, I got to remind myself that walking makes me feel good, man. There's, there's just a natural movement about it. I'm not triggering appetite. I'm able to continue fasting and I feel natural. I feel like alive now. It's crazy. Like a, it's just so momentum based. If I'm not walking, I'm literally, I, I, I feel like I'm just not myself. I'm not as enthusiastic. And while I am enthusiastic naturally, I'm training myself in enthusiasm and I recommend you do the same. And I do it by saying, you know, having a talk with myself saying, hey, you are enthusiastic, so act enthusiastic. Zig Zig, uh, it was uh, Zig Zig, or it was Zig Ziglar said that, you know, if you want to be enthusiastic, then act enthusiastic, okay? And, and ultimately, enthusiasm is really another key to happiness. Uh, it's up here in Tahoe, say, uh, South Shore here for the weekend. And it can be a little challenging to not do massive big breakfast with friends. And massive big lunch with friends and they're having these giant pancakes and they're having eggs and omelets and the food's incredible and it looks so good it's very tempting and i just I, it can be a little bit of a challenge and, and and it can almost be weird in a way where they don't understand and i'm not trying to to, to explain something they don't want to hear about you know if they don't want to hear about it or ask i'm not going to tell them they're, they're not motivated they're you know it's, it's not it's not my not my place to you know try to convince them to do something they don't want to do and um, but it's, it can be a little bit awkward almost. So I just come clean about it. Like when we sit down in a restaurant for breakfast or brunch or something, I come clean. I say, listen guys, I know it's weird, but I'm not gonna order any food. Please don't take it personal. I'm gonna have a, a coffee or a sparkling water, that's it. I just come clean about it instantly. So I don't have them asking or wondering, well, what's going on? Why aren't you eating something right now? Everybody else is eating. It's kind of a, so I am gonna have a giant meal tonight. I can't wait. State line right there. That's the state line for California, Nevada. And Harris, for those who don't come to Tahoe much. State line. Let's start the vlog for the night. I'm gonna go eat at a, at a, at a Thai restaurant. And I got a new nickname, people call me the Johnny Bravo now. Whatever that is. And I got this girl, Marilyn, she keeps calling me Johnny Bravo because I grew my hair out a little bit blonder and it's a little bit longer now. And she says, oh, you're Johnny Bravo, this cartoon character. I said, okay, great. So now I did, a, I did the aesthetic pose and look like him. It's a freaking cartoon, I don't even know what it is. But thank you, Marilyn, it was a nice compliment. Now I'm gonna go eat, bye. It's like a little tunnel I pass through underneath the ground from Harris to Harvey's. Her Harvey's to Harris now. Back up. Somebody says, what's up? Johnny Bravo. Say hi. Two seconds. 